Hey guys, welcome to me reacting to SML Movie Taken to Court by SML. Now, I have not seen this, but it seems like this one's a shorter video based on the, the runtime. So, it, it seems like a, a shorter one rather than, you know, usually like a longer scale video, which is fine. Honestly, I don't mind that. I already have a feeling I kind of know with what this episode's gonna be. It, it, there's gonna be something, there's gonna be some like lawyer uh, divorce jokes here and there. And I can already tell based on the thumbnail and also just cause, yeah, I mean, of course you're gonna make that jokes when there's a court case, even though, you know, I feel like you could do a lot more with a court case, but, but still, uh, they're probably gonna do that. And you know, I, I feel like doing all the, yeah. Cause it's kind of the lazy way out. Because I feel like a lot of people have made fun of, oh, this divorce, you know, all that, you know, all that kind, those kind of jokes. So, yeah, that probably why. But, yeah, anyways, guys, we're kings in the description. Make sure to SML links. So, in the description, let's just get right into it. So, guys, what do you want to do today? I have a special announcement. What is it, National Dork Day? Ha, <laughs> they made a holiday for him. Here comes the big dork. <laughs> Here he comes. No, no, it's not National Dork Day. Then what is it, Cody? Look at my hand. I can't believe you fell for Oh that. no, wait, never mind. I don't care what your announcement is, Cody. But, but I really do have something on my hand, though. No, I'm he not going to He got married to Ken. Really cool. Oh no, no. wait. Look, look. I don't care. Don't show. I don't want to look at it. N no way. way. No, so I can fall for it? Uh uh. You're not going to get me. Guys, come on. Please, please look at my hand, Daddy. If you back up a few feet, then I'll look. Okay. Whoa, what is that? Ken proposed. Oh, he's a doll. He can't propose. What? Can do that. <laughs> what, do you think I just went through my mom's jewelry, found a ring, put it on my finger, and then it got stuck, so I just pretended Ken proposed so I'd have an excuse to have a ring on my finger? Yeah. I didn't, I didn't do that. I'm not lame. So when's the wedding? Okay. Tomorrow. What, tomorrow? That's like tomorrow. Well, yeah, we didn't want to wait. You know, we want to go on our honeymoon. I can't wait to put some honey in his moon. Oh, well, I hope you have fun at your dumb wedding. Well, guys, I have to pick a best man for my wedding. But what's a best man? He's like my best friend that gets to stand next to me at the wedding. You have to choose your best friend? Well, obviously it's me. Wait, wait, no, I'm his Oh, best God, we're doing friend. this? I'm his best friend. I know all the Cody facts. I know Cody facts, too, dude. Oh, wait, really? Well, so, so how many eyes does Cody have? Uh, two. No, he has four. Get it right. Well, how many pimples does he have on his face? Uh... Ah, don't look! Um, ten? Nope, eleven. You forgot about the ugly one on the back of his head. Yeah, I do have one. Babe. That is a really big, gross pimple. Yes, yeah, gross. Okay, then why does Cody always smell like onions? Uh, because what? he doesn't bathe every day. How many, how many times a week does he bathe? Uh, three times a week. No, he bathes one time a week. God, I forgot. What uh, are you guys talking about? What? Cody, I am the best choice to be your best man, because look at my bib. It's, it has a JR on it. That means I'm just right to be your best man. Well, look at my bib. Well, that's stupid, my shirt. stupid reason. Me having the best shot at being your best man. No, 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 no. The back means he should bounce and get out of here and well, leave. The JR on your shirt means, uh, just wrong. <laughs> well, well, wrong, actually starts with a W. Cody, you are so dumb. Wrong starts with an R. That's why it makes the R, R noise, like wrong. No, it's it's spelled W-R-O-N-G. That would be wrong. What would this rabbit start with a W? Not unless you're on my foot. Yeah, wabbit season, it's rabbit season. Wrong starts with the R. You guys are really making it hard to pick who my best man's gonna be. Yeah, what? Be best friend. No, it should be me. So this is what we're doing to start out the video? Hold on, hold on. Let me, let me tell you something in your ear. Why are you licking my ear, Junior? It is you, though. That was pretty freaky. Oh, yeah. I'm the best man. It's not fair, dude. You know what? You can have it. I'm not going to lick his and ear. And then Bro, Joseph's well, just the out of the man, video. So I'm best friend, so I win. What, what, look, I don't even want to be the best man anyway. It's a stupid little wedding anyway, dude. I'm out of here. Bye. I'm yeah, yeah bye. See you. Ya. Can't man. wait to see you oh, next so video. I'm your best man. What does that mean I have to do? Well, you just have to, you know, stand next to me and uh, just support me. Wait. I have to be at the wedding? Oh, well, yeah. I didn't know that. I didn't want to go to your wedding. What, what, you have to be at my wedding. Well, when is it? Tomorrow. I'm going to be busy. What, what, Junior, what are you going to do to <laughs> My grandfather's going to die. How do you know? Because he's on life support, and we're pulling the plug tomorrow. But I didn't tell you when the wedding's happening. What time's the wedding tomorrow? Noon. Noon, Noon is when we're pulling the plug. Okay. What? There's someone at the door. I'll get it. It's my house. Hello. Hey, may I speak with Ken, please? Oh, well, I'm his fiance, so if he died, I'd be his next of Ken, so you can talk to me. Well, I have a lot to go over. May I come inside? Of what? Yeah, yeah like he has like a family. Uh, yes, you can come inside. Well, thank you. Of what, though? Here's Ken, but he's spoken for. Okay, well, my name's Mr. Goodman, and I'm the attorney representing this case. May I ask you a few questions, Ken? He says yes. 
Okay. Well, do you happen to know a lady by the name of Barquisha Jones? Barquisha Jones? No. Okay. Well, what about Poofball Tina? Poofball? No, we don't know who that is. Okay. Well, we got one more here, and her name is Jessica. Do you know Jessica? No. Who are these women? Well, all three of these women claim to have had a child with Ken, and here are the children right here. Wait, no! 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 Okay, stop playing Star Wars. This is serious. What? Why don't we ask Ken. Ken, do you know these women? K Ken, Ken, be honest, baby. We can get through anything. Did you boink these ladies? Mmm, by a silence? I, I already know the answer. But that smile, he knows exactly what he did. But, no, 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 no. Ken, Ken just wants to plead the fifth. Okay, well, a simple DNA test would prove whether Ken is or is not the father, so... They're gonna do a Jerry Springer parody? Watch. Who would be preferable? Okay, well, give us a few minutes. I need some privacy. Well, I can just do it. Oh, you want a piece, too? Oh, what a coincidence that the day before my wedding to the man of my dreams, all of these bimbos show up and now they all want a piece. Well, let's just get the DNA sample going and we'll be good to go. <sighs> Fine. So, Cody, do you think Ken's the father of any of these kids? No, Junior, the kids don't even look like him. But I understand why the women would want to lie about it. Ken is a lawyer, astronaut, doctor, scientist that plays for the NBA, so he does have millions. I can't really blame him for wanting to check. But, you know, we'll have all the answers soon enough. All right, I got the results back, and it turns out that I'm 100% rich. Yeah, that's actually my bank statement. But anyway, I did get the DNA test back. And what? Ken, you are the father. <laughs> Literally, literally called it. Screw you, kid. You have fun with your women and their boobies. Cody, you're not going to stay with him? No, no, I thought I was with a real man who liked men, not stupid, stinky girls who have axe wounds in their pants. I'm going to go eat a whole can of Vienna sausages and think about how. So, where does this lead to? This is so good, man. What's going to happen with Ken now? Well, Ken owes all these women thousands of dollars in back child support, so he better get to work. Well, I'm going to go check on Cody. <laughs> I is Ken. Who's that guy? Can you do that to me? Are you okay, Cody? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm great. I, I, I don't even miss Ken at all. No, no, I have a new boyfriend now. What, you already have a new boyfriend? Yeah, yeah, this is Joe. And hey, check this out. The music he switch. He moves, Junior. Ken's mouth couldn't move. The possibilities are endless. He can do things Ken couldn't even dream of doing. That That's really cool. But yeah. are you sure you don't want to give Ken a second chance? No, no, I'm done with Ken. I don't need him. Why? Well, because because he cheated on me and he has three kids now. Well, well, maybe he didn't cheat on you. Maybe he had the kids before he met you. Junior, those kids were babies. I met Ken seven years ago. Those kids weren't seven years old. That means he cheated on me. Well, well, maybe he just made a mistake. No, Junior, it's not a mistake. If you do it three times, that's called a habit. Well, what about the third time the charm thing? That's with good things, not kids. Oh, well, I just you yeah, and Ken what? dated for so long and. Okay. I don't really like Joe that much. Oh, come on, Junior. Did I not show you the mouth thing? I mean, hey, check this out. Hey, hey, Joe, would you ever cheat on me? No, Cody, I'd never cheat on you. And if I did, it would be with a big, hunky dude. And then you could join. Would you like to do that, Cody? Oh, yeah, I'd love that, Joe. That's a great idea. See? Well, look, 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 how about I go get Ken, and then you may maybe he'll what? change your mind. No, no, don't bring him into this. Hey, Ken, let's go talk to Cody. He's acting crazy. <sighs> Wait, Joseph, what are you doing? Uh, nothing. Who's this? Oh, uh, it's salt and paprika. Where'd you get her from? Oh, I got her from Target. Wait a minute. Uh, what? Did you buy all these dolls? Oh, dang it, dude, you got me. Look, don't tell Cody, but he made me mad when he didn't make me his best man. Oh, what? So I went to Target and I bought all these dolls to make it look like King got him pregnant. So I guess I was wrong. Joseph is still here. Dude, he made me mad when he didn't make me his best man. But you made him cry. He made me cry. I was in the bathroom tearing up, and then he didn't even check on me. Well, we have to go tell Cody the truth. No, we don't, dude. Look, if he stays mad at Ken, look, we won't ever have to see Ken again. You're right. Cody needs to grow up. And he needs to get rid of Ken anyway, so this is the best way to get rid of Ken. Exactly. We won't tell him the truth. So, 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 just, just so that he gets Okay, this is an interesting hey, okay, Cody, plot, I guess. Yeah, me and my new boyfriend Joe are going to break up because he has a brain tumor and I didn't sign up for that. So I'll just take Ken and his kids. Wait, you're actually going to accept Ken's kids? Well, yeah, I thought about it. And I do love Ken. Well, he has another one, dude. Yeah, yeah, he has another kid you don't know about. She, it, it just popped out. Ooh, ouch. Well, that's okay. What's one more at this point, right? Me and Ken were gonna adopt anyway, and at least now they can have his perfect genes. So you're really gonna take care of all of Ken's kids? Yep, I'm gonna raise them like my own family and take them with me wherever I go. Take them with you wherever you go? Yep, every time I come over here, I'm gonna have to bring all of them. 
Okay, dude, I did all this. Look, I was mad at you for not making me your best man, so I went to Target and I bought all these beautiful ladies to make it look wow. like you got them pregnant. <sighs> okay, I did all this, so uh, I'm just gonna take these back to the store and get my money back. <clears throat> Don't forget the babies. Oh, oh, can't yeah. leave the babies. Uh, Are you mad, Cody? No, no, actually, this worked out pretty good. Oh, and hey, Ken. Joe only has a few days left to live, but look at what that mouth do. <laughs> We're gonna have a good time with that. Come on, Ken. Is the wedding still happening? So yeah, honestly, this video was not good. I, I, I couldn't understand people liking it. There are jokes here and there, but when it comes to the plot, it just left me with nothing. This video really just left me with nothing, in my opinion. Like, it started out with the whole Junior and Joseph like bickering sort of thing, which honestly was just painful to watch. Well, not painful, but just kind of annoying because, well, yeah, like it's just one of those times where it's like, oh, they're arguing over something dumb, y you know, and it just doesn't amount to anything. And then the whole like court thing, I did not expect it to go that route, but it kind of, kind of went a route that I didn't really enjoy. I mean, I wish it went to, like, an actual court case, because that would have been interesting. Because at the beginning, I thought that they were going to do, like, oh, the voice, the, the, the voice, the divorce lawyer sort of jokes. Like, oh, you know. And I was right, however, I was right about the Jerry Springer joke, predicting that. But I thought it would be, like, more, they would do, like, more kind of jokes like that. Like, oh, sort of, like. Oh, this guy owes me a, yeah, like, uh, you know, like that sort of thing. Or there's going to be like some big argument in court. And I kind of wish that was the case because I feel like that actually had to be potential to be funny. However, it could have not been funny and just be very annoying filler. So I, I yeah, there, there was a 50-50 shot there. But it, I feel like they would have, but I feel like with that, they would have at least tried something. Whereas this, it just doesn't feel like they tried in my opinion, because I feel like I kind of knew where this was going once, you know, Cody kind of went to the Joe guy or whatever, like I knew he'd go back to Ken at the end, and yeah, the twist that like Joseph, you know, planted the sort of thing, uh, because of what happened before, honestly, I just find that really stupid, and in my opinion, it just leaves me with no impact, I'm like, oh, I was wrong about Joseph not being in the, the rest of the video, because usually what happens is that he leaves and then he just never shows up again. So yeah, I mean, I guess some people might have not seen that coming, but either way, and same thing with me, I didn't see it coming either. But either way, for me, it just it leaves me with no impact, in my opinion. Well, it leaves me with no impact. <laughs> but, but yeah, anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the like videos for my channel, see you next one, bye.